Good morning, folks. Talk with AOK Foraging Adventures here with Brenda. She looked like she had a little glummy face this morning, didn't she? <laughs> we just got up. Coffee's not done yet. All right. <laughs> what are we doing this weekend, babe? It's uh, not the weekend, though. It's a yeah, Monday. It's, not. it's a Monday. Yeah. We are camping. camping. Yep. And we found a pond. We're private fish, pond yeah. that we're going to try and fish. Yep. yep. So we're going to get breakfast going. Come back and join us. Yep. The sun sets in water and it comes at dark Why did you care for me? Why did you run? And when they asked about me, said life was all good But when it crashes down, tears are full too and I run, and I run, and I run, and I run to get food. Well, folks, we uh, cleared ourselves a trail to the pond. We just got our lines in. Let me show you this awesome pond we found. See it? Let me zoom out a little. There you go. It's about hmm, an acre. Maybe it's less. It's less than an acre, but it's pretty. It is secluded, I tell you. And while most of the ponds around the area have dried up, this place has not. And I've seen a couple big bullfrogs. I don't know if you can see our bobber. There's my bobber, the red thing right there. And Brenda's is that green one right there. It has not moved. Whoa. As I said that, you guys see that big pool over there with the bubbles? That was something. So anyways, we're going to continue to fish. So cause since there's uh, something in the water. <laughs> Back at camp. No fish. But look, I get lunch. Brenda's going to use the griddle thingamajigger. Uh, and she's going to make us some... What is it, babe? Ham and cheese. Ham ooh, and cheese. You okay? Yeah. On your thing again. All right, so I am going to have the cheddar and monster. Are you having provolone? Probably. On our ham. Right there. All right. We'll see you guys in a minute. Well, folks, so Brenda and I finished lunch, mm -hmm. and then we decided let's drive around, get to know this area a little more. And then we found the only state forest in Iowa, so that's pretty darn cool. Um, did you want to get out and look, or just keep driving? No, I'll keep driving. Yeah, we're going to keep driving. Um, it's pretty cool. There's a little spot here, the pit, Nick. Yeah, it looks like it. Anyways, let me flip you guys around and let you see it. The fire ring. See the fire ring right over there? Oh, there we go. It looks like there's a little bit of firewood already waiting for the next person. So that's pretty cool that this was here. Yeah, pretty cool. Yep. 
Looks like some kids left some stuff around. So we're going to just keep driving and see how things are. This is a nice little area. We found a pond already. Right, honey? Yep. A boy's hunting. Yep. But look at those clouds. Look at those ominous clouds. <laughs> well, folks, we're back from our drive, and if you can hear it, it's finally raining we have been in such a bad drought it's not good that it's raining during our uh, camping time but it is good that it is raining so i think i'm gonna lay here read a book brenda is gonna take a nap we'll see you guys later on well folks nap is over and you know the rain just wouldn't stop just wouldn't stop and well, it's time for second lunch, and I'm hungry. <laughs> so we decided to move everything into the shooting shack. We got our, our, where, where am I going? That way, right here. Our potatoes are boiling for tonight's supper. Not right now. Brenda, right there, is cleaning up yep. the shack for, you know, for letting us use it, of course. We always clean as we go as much as possible. Um, keep it, you know, the way it was when we came in or better. Yep. Anyways, what are we having for our second lunch, babe? Because the sandwiches were actually brunch, so. I know. Oh, yeah, we're having cheesy shells with fried pork chop in it. Mm. So, we'll see you guys later. All right, like I said, here we have the pork that we're frying up. So they'll get cooked separately. And then there's our uh, cheesy shells or something like that, spirals. Right there, cooking up nicely. I think I'll leave the lid off so it can reduce. And keep frying the pork until it's done. Oh, this is going to be great. Well, folks, our second lunch is done. Yep. Nothing fancy. Nothing fancy. But for some reason, everybody likes to see what we're eating. I don't know. <laughs> so there you have it. We are probably going to eat, do a little shooting. We yep. are not going to video us shooting, I don't think. Because um, we're just testing ammo. Yeah. Yeah, well, she bought the P365. I bought the P365XL. And so, yeah, we're just going to test some ammo. Yep. We need some lunch first, though. Um, if the rain stops, we might try fishing. We might. I doubt it, though. We might. It we might, yeah. yeah. Anyways, see you guys later. Brenda. What did we just do? Move back down to our tent. Yeah, we moved the camp back outside because the rain decided to leave and it was so gorgeous we weren't going to stay in the shack. So that's where we're at. Back outside. Look at those steaks. Oh yeah. Got two little pork chops on there. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Well, folks, supper is done. We have our baked potatoes. Mm -hmm. Oh, steak. Pork chops if we get more hungry for more meat. <laughs> folks, we're just going to enjoy supper. And then... Have a big fire. Have a big fire. Um, enjoy our last night here together. Um, yep. So, we probably won't film anymore because the sun is going down and stuff. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for all your support. Um, I would like to give a big shout out to Redbird491. 
Her birthday is coming up. So happy birthday, Redbird491. Yes, happy um, birthday. This video she dropped on her birthday. So, <laughs> um, anyways, check out her link in the description box below, folks. Until next time, may, may all, all your, your adventures, adventures be a-okay. -okay.